guys, in today's Django video, like in the previous video of Django, I told you about the pre-template, prepare template, and in today's video, I am telling you about the uh, how in the Django how to add the links to details. So yeah, I am telling you about that. So please hit the like button, share your friends, and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to all the notification bell also, so you never miss our future latest videos. So now. I do not take a long time, so let's move down to your screen and let's do a coding with loving. So guys, in today's Django video, I am telling about the how to add a link to details. So yeah, I am telling about that, so get ready for that. So let's get started and let's, uh, in the Django, let's add a link to details. So let's get started. Details template. The next step is our web page will be add to a details page where we can list more details about a specified member. We start by creating a new template called details.html and now um, we create one file about the details.html okay let's create this file if you create that file so let me tell you what you can do you go already here and then you can paste it and run it I'm just running from very okay when I run it should give you here you can see it is giving me my member dot first name my member dot last name then phone number my member dot phone then member signs my member dot join date back to members then we i click to the back to members so it comes like that here you can see it like that you can do it and let's go to the google and let's go to the home and when i go to the home so let me click right click and let me uh, sorry not that let me delete that and then let me create one django file and let me create a REPL. When I create a REPL, so it take a little bit loading, but it will be open it very easily. Yes. Now, when it will be open it very easily, so it take a little bit loading. So now, what I can do? I make here one file by the name of details dot html. When I make this file here, I paste this code and I will be run it. So when I run it, so it is giving me like this type of output. Here you can see it. Like that you can do it. Like that. Here you can see it. So now let's come on it here so now let's come down now you add a link to all members template in the all members as template this list in all member the estimates will be clickable and take you to the details page with the id of the member you click on like this here you can see it uh, in the all member html so may you in the previous video already make that file about the all members.py so I do not make this another time so but let me make it if you are have a problem to making that file so let me tell you you can you go here and write here stm all members.html then your file has been made it like that so here you can see it so here you can see it, your file has been made it very easily yes and it gives you the output like that here you can see it so now let's come here and let me stop the server now now you can create our new view.py file then create a new view dot, uh, view in the view.py file that will deal with incoming request to create a details url like in this example when you copy the example like that copy that and let me tell you what you can do then when you copy it so go into the your Google Chrome you can make here one file by the name of one new file by the name of what by the name let me see okay I see the file name is views.py when you make that file you can paste this code here and then when you may paste this code so then it will be give you the output okay like that here you can see it it not give you the any any different output okay but it will output is giving you so now what you can do now the details view does the following number one it gets the id as an argument number two it uses the id to locate the correct record in the member table number three it loads the details.html template number four it creates an object it containing the member number five it create it sends the object to the template number six it outputs the template HTML that is rendered by the template. Then you add a URLs. Now we need to make sure that the details URL points to the current correct view with the ID as a parameter. 
then you open the urls.py file and add the details view to the url patrons list open your urls.py file there's your urls.py file and then you paste this code here here now here you can see it when i paste it like that so now let me tell you what you can do now now if you have followed all the steps on your own computer you can see the result in your browser if you follow my whole step app so then you will found the result in your browser if the server is down you start to uh, uh, it again the server run server command if the server is down so you can another time you write this type of command py manage.py if you are on the window in the visual studio code so for the visual studio code i am telling you about that but if i run it from here so it give me the output like that here you can see it my member dot html let me see that so here you can see it it give me the output like my members dot py let me close it like here you can see it my members dot py last name like that here you can see it is giving me the output very easily yes my member dot first name my member dot last name phone number then back to members like that it is giving me so here you can see like that you can do it very easily yes so in today's Django video I told you about the uh, about how to in the Django water how to add a links to how uh, to add a link to details and it give you the out output also here you can see like that so I hope you can enjoy this class if you enjoy so please hit a like button share your friend and subscribe to my channel do not forget to all the notification bell also so you never miss our future latest videos so now I appreciate your support through if you generally appreciate my work so please let your friends know about this course too and if you haven't checked out my whole playlist yet, so move on to the code with Rayan, sorry, code with PK.com on my YouTube channel so you can easily access it and bookmark it also. So now, I meet you next class in the next video, amazing color, like that type of videos. So for today, goodbye.